Yes, hello everyone. Welcome on your Pudia platform. I hope you all are fine. So guys, today I am here in front of you with very important job notification related to Damodar Valley Corporation. So guys, DVC, they are announcing some job vacancies for the post of graduate engineering training in various engineering domains like uh, civil, electrical, mechanical, IT communication based on GATE 2022. So guys, if you qualified GATE 2020 with some sufficient good GATE score, then you can apply. This year, so many PSUs companies coming, recruiting based on GATE uh, 2022. So guys, you can apply. But yes, if you are having two 2021 score or prior GATE score, then you are not eligible to apply. You need to have some sufficient good GATE score of this uh, particular, last particular year. 2022 okay so guys dvc as you know they majorly damodar valley corporation they majorly deals in thermal power station and hydro power station so uske liye, they are recruiting power engineers actually uh, for the post of graduate engineering training in these various engineering domains so they mentioned very clearly the number of vacancies mechanical ke liye, electrical ke liye, civil ke liye. Uh, i think this c and i is for communication uh, yes it and communication so this c and i is it communication this is separately IT and this is communication. Okay, so these are the number of vacancies. In uh, uh, they are offering salary in the pay band 10. Okay, as per the seventh pay commission, seventh pay revision. So seventh pay revision case is upset, pay level pay, pay band 10 may they are offering uh, salary in this range 56,100 to 177,500. So initial salary I think will be in the range of 85, 90,000. Okay, that will be the initial beginning salary. 29 is a maximum age limit to apply guys for general category student but yes there is a age relaxation as per the government of India rules 3 year age relaxation for OBC category students non year. 5 year age relaxation is there for SC and ST category student and 10 year additional gate uh, additional age relaxation is there for PWD category student guys so all age relaxations are applicable as per the government of India rules guys Wo sab applicable rahega. So, थोड़ा और देख लेते हैं इसके बारे में देयर आर सम सीट्स रिजर्व फॉर पीडब्ल्यूडी कैटेगरी स्टूडेंट्स आल्सो गाइस पीडब्ल्यूडी के लिए सीट्स रिजर्व है छह सीट्स है जिसमें दो सीट लो विजन में है दो सीट दे आर ऑफरिंग इन डीफ एंड हार्ड ऑफ हियरिंग एचएच जो शॉर्ट भी लिखते हैं लोकोमोटर डिसेबिलिटी में भी दे आर ऑफरिंग वन सीट दीस आर द सम ऑफ द डिसेबिलिटीज दे मेंशन और स्पेशल लर्निंग डिसेबिलिटी में भी दे आर हैविंग वन सीट सो द टोटल सिक्स सीट्स आर रिजर्व्ड फॉर पीडब्ल्यूडी कैटेगरी स्टूडेंट्स ओके PWD mein alag se chai seats hai. they have not mentioned I think here so there are 6 additional seats for PWD category students eligibility criteria rahega, gate 2022 and this is very important guys BTEC if you are having eligible uh, you know BTEC degree in mechanical industrial production industrial thermal mechanical automation power engineering you are eligible to apply so you need, you need to check if you are having BTEC in welding obviously you are not eligible to apply Okay, if you are having BTEC in CAD CAM, CAD CAM also is not there. Most of the time, BTEC you are not going to find it in CAD CAM, but yes, there are some universities offer BTEC in power engineering like that. So uh, then you are eligible to apply. So BTEC in power you are eligible to apply, but gate paper you need to have in what? Mechanical engineering. So these are the eligible uh, discipline, BTEC discipline, BTEC degree you need to have in any one of these uh, di uh, discipline and BTEC paper, the gate paper must be in mechanical. So if you appeared in, uh, even if you are having BTEC in mechanical, but suppose you appeared in gate PI or you appeared in gate engineering uh, sciences, then you are not eligible to apply. So you need to have BTEC in these disciplines or uh, gate paper in this mechanical for applying to GET position mechanical. Similarly, for GET position electrical, you need to have BTEC in these particular domains, electrical, electrical, electronics, electrical instrumentation and control, power system, high voltage, power electronics, power engineering. But the gate paper must be electrical. Similarly, for civil, uh, for uh, communication, okay, I think this is control, control. Uh, let me check again. So this C and I, they mentioned somewhere. Okay, I think this is control, control and automation, IT communication they mentioned separately. So this is control and automation guys, I think. So C and I is control only because the subject which we are observing here are related to instrumentation and control. Okay, so this is control and uh, automation. So yes, so these are the BTEC domains and the gate paper must be in instrumentation. Okay, control and instrumentation, they are mentioning it, this branch, C and I like that, control and instrumentation. Okay. So BTEC paper must be in instrumentation but BTEC degree in these domains are eligible to apply for this domain instrumentation. Similarly gate IT, IT ke liye again BTEC paper must be in, uh, gate paper must be in computer science, BTEC degree must be in what computer science and IT. GT communication BTEC in these domains and gate paper in this particular branch. 
चलिए अपर एज लिमिट ऑलरेडी आई डिस्कस विद यू ट्वेंटी नाइन दीज आर द एसेंशियल बीटेक क्वालिफिकेशन दे मेंशन ऑलरेडी आई डिस्कस विद यू बट फर्दर यू कैन चेक इट हेयर फॉर जनरल कैटेगरी स्टूडेंट्स यू नीड टू हैव एटलीस्ट सिक्सटी फाइव परसेंट बट यस फॉर एस सी एस टी ई डब्ल्यू सी ओ बी सी देर इज अ फर्दर रिलेक्शेशन विद सिक्सटी परसेंट यू आर एलिजिबल टू अपलाई ओके जनरल स्टूडेंट के लिए सिक्सटी फाइव परसेंट बट सिक्सटी परसेंट फॉर एस सी एस टी जनरल ओ बी सी एन सी एल ई डब्ल्यू एस यू नीड टू हैव सिक्सटी फाइव परसेंट गाइज ओके बट फॉर एस सी एस टी सिक्सटी परसेंट यू कैन अप्लाई फाइन सो दिस एलिजिबिलिटी इज सेम परसेंटेज इज सेम यू कैन चेक इट हेयर फॉर ईच एंड एवरी ब्रांच ओके आई थिंक दिस इज फर्दर इंपॉर्टेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन रिलेक्सेशन ऑलरेडी आई डिस्कस विद यू द एज रिलेक्सेशन थ्री ईयर एज रिलेक्सेशन फाइव ईयर एज रिलेक्सेशन फॉर एस सी एस टी पी डब्ल्यू डी के लिए टेन ईयर एज एज रिलेक्सेशन ओके चलिए सो आई होप यू विल गो थ्रू दिस पर्टिकुलर नोटिफिकेशन इफ यू आर हैविंग सम गुड सफिशियंट गेट स्कोर सिलेक्शन प्रोसेस गाइज दिस इज अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट इन्फॉर्मेशन विच आई नीड टू डिस्कस विद यू सो गाइज दे आर गोइंग टू सिलेक्ट यू बेस्ड ऑन इनिशियली दे आर गोइंग टू शॉर्ट लिस्ट यू बेस्ड ऑन यूर गेट टू जीरो टू टू स्कोर Based on your gate two 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 zero two two marks actually, based on your two two zero two two marks, they are going to shortlist you. Okay, so they are going to prepare some merit list accordingly, and then they will shortlist you for GD and PI. So some uh, group discussion and personal interview will be there. Okay, and they are giving actually eighty five. They are going to give in final merit list. They are going to prepare based on the gate score, uh, the personal interview and GD. Okay, and eighty five. Percent weightage they are going to give to the gate marks. Okay, but initial shortage will be there. Short listing will be there based on the gate score, gate marks, and then uh, you need to appear in GD and PI. Okay, चलिए. So only two zero two two score uh, is valid. Okay, merit list one ratio ten. In the ratio of ten uh, times candidates they are going to short list for the GD and PI guys. So दस गुना बच्चों को ये बुला बुलाने वाले हैं. Suppose if there are in mechanical. Suppose there are uh, how many vacancies? Let me check. in mechanical they mentioned i think some vacancies yes so total vacancies are 27 so close to 270 students they are going to shortlist for mechanical similarly for other branches also you can check and you can get some idea okay but don't feel guys only like if my rank is in the range of 500 sir then only it is good to apply no guys this year there are so many vacancies so what i feel even if your uh, rank is in the range of 500 to uh, 5 1500 or 2000 then also you you can take a risk because there is no such much amount only 3 300 unit to pay that is only fees and it is good to try even if your rank is in the range of 2000 okay general category and even for obc other uh, reserved category further you can take some more uh, you know uh, uh, you can uh, take a kind of leverage and you can go with some higher rank okay in that case of uh, reserved category okay so selection process okay so yes so 85% weightage will be there gate score 3% weightage will be there for the group discussion marks they are going to give you out of 50 but finally they will convert those marks out of 3 okay so 3% weightage final merit list they are going to prepare out of 100 similarly personal interview minimum qualify marks are 25 you need to score at least 25 marks in the interview okay out of 50 but the weightage of the interview is 12% so they are going to uh, you know carry out some kind of conversion and finally they will give you marks out of 12 okay and then they will prepare a final merit list out of 100 okay chaliye so yes they mentioned very easily uh, they mentioned very clearly here uh, 50% Minimum uh, marks are required. Forty percent minimum marks are required for what SC, ST, and PWD category students. Okay, so these are some of the detail, guys. I discuss with you uh, related to this application fees is three hundred. Now let us move to the uh, important dates. Okay, three year agreement bond is there, guys. Service agreement bond is there. Total four years का bond है. One year का probation period के time, training period के time, and three year additional bond you need to provide. So five lakh is the bond amount for general category students. And two lakh, two point five lakh is a uh, bond amount for SC, ST students. Okay, yes, SC, ST, and PWD. This is for general OBC and NCL. They are going to carry out some kind of medical, obviously, before finally going to give you the offer. Okay, so these are some of the another details, guys. Let me now move to the uh, important dates. These are the document, guys. You need to bring at the time of interview. Further, you can explore this notification. So these are the document, guys. You need to produce at the time of the interview. Okay, and GD. Chali. So there are some further some more detail, guys. Some instructions uh, uh, will be required. You need to go through all these instructions uh, uh, when you go through the application portal, guys. Because before going to apply, 
you need to go through all these instructions so that you will get information yes what you need to upload and how you need to fill the form so from 3rd of December the application form is now open you can apply you can pay the fees uh, from 3rd of December and the last date is 31st December so before uh, 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 23rd uh, uh, 59 means uh, last up 12 pm what I can say usse pehle pehle aapko payment karna padega uh, 31st December ko so provisionally can, uh, can, uh, shortlisting they will carry out after that obviously they, may, may, ca ca they can carry out some shortlisting in the year in the month of January or February okay that we can expect so I feel the entire process they will complete uh, before January or uh, before uh, June or July next year okay so very good opportunity guys based on 2022 gate score so please apply if you feel you are having a sufficient gate score and if you are having some contact with us you can reach to us okay you can discuss with the mentor so is it will be it will be good for you to apply or not or you can shoot your query in the comment section thank you very much keep preparing and apply timely if you are meeting all those requirements and if you are having some good gate score thank you good luck keep preparing